Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Boom. Sessions picks hard-nosed prosecutor to bust Obama gate wide open. Attorney General Jeff Sessions has decided against assigning a special counsel to investigate accusations against the FBI for the moment. Sessions announced Thursday that he's chosen a slightly different route, and it promises to yield great results. John Huba, Utah's top federal prosecutor, will be looking into allegations, from Republicans, that the FBI abused its powers during the 2016 presidential election, and illegally surveilled a former Trump campaign advisor. He'll also investigate Hillary Clinton's ties to a Russian-backed nuclear energy company. The announcement of a D.C. outsider to head the investigation is directly in line with the president's Drain the Swamp framework. The decision came along with a lengthy written letter from Sessions, explaining the situation more thoroughly. Sessions states, Well, I have great respect for Mr. Gowdy and Chairman Goodlatte, and we are going to consider seriously their recommendations. I have appointed a person outside of Washington, many years in the Department of Justice to look at all the allegations that the House Judiciary Committee members sent to us and we're conducting that investigation. Also I am well aware we have a responsibility to ensure the integrity of the FISA process, we are not afraid to look at that. The Inspector General, some think that our Inspector General is not very strong, but he has almost 500, employees, most of which are lawyers and prosecutors, and they are looking at the FISA process, he added. GOP lawmakers expressed support for the decision, while we continue to believe that the appointment of a second special counsel is necessary. This is a step in the right direction, House Judiciary Chairman Bob Goodlatte of Virginia and House Oversight Chairman Trey Gowdy of South Carolina said in a statement late Thursday. We applaud the Attorney General for demonstrating his commitment to this investigation by selecting an individual outside of Washington, D.C. to lead the review. Hoover's track record indicates that he'll fight fiercely for the truth. Do you think he'll produce results? That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.